The Valavatta Business Community Forum featuring speakers from the National People's Power was held in Colombo. I told IMF, you came and gave 16 loans to Sri Lanka in the past. We failed 16 times. That is because you worked with corrupt politicians in Sri Lanka. That is why you failed as an institution. So if you try to do it for the 17th time, no matter how good is your program, you are bound to fail because you are working with a corrupt lot on the ground. This is why we have to work differently this time, have a different approach to come out from the issues that we have. One of the short-term measures, immediate measures that we will implement upon coming into forming the government is stabilization of the economy. We will work with IMF, we will work with the external creditors. We have told them very clearly, as of now, the way how previous governments have recklessly borrowed, we are sitting on a mountain of debt of $100 billion. IMF is giving us a loan of $2.3 billion. When we have a debt mountain of $100 billion, you can't set it off or you can't figure out a way just with $3 billion loan from IMF. We need to work out a different plan. That is where the governance structure has to be relooked at. For Sri Lanka, the politician has become far too important, being too much influence in every area of our lives. Unless we have a politician is able to wield influence, most of us will experience that nothing ever gets done in this country. So whether it's getting your child admitted to a school, whether it's getting the necessary approvals for your business, whether it's um, making sure that your hosp in, in hospital you get proper treatment, whether it's getting your car license, whether it's anything, the most mundane of activities in Sri Lanka requires a political intervention. That is not the role of the politician. The politician should not be intervening at every stage, at every point in your life. The politician's role is to act as your representative and to maintain fiscal discipline and to maintain that the political will to implement a vision is provided and that leadership is provided. In our policy, we will limit ministries to the 25 ministries, 25 ministries which will be named and uh, which cannot be changed. There will be 25 ministers, 25 deputy ministers, that is all.